What's good YouTube? Welcome back to my crypto journey. My name is Rodney and it is Wednesday my dudes. So it's time for an Olympus Dow update video. Now since last week I did buy one point one more ohm and if you like these olympus dow videos let me know i could probably make them more than once per week but a lot of people really don't watch them but if i get more people that want to see this content i'll definitely make more and maybe we can do our journey together because like i said i'm going to be doing this journey as long as the runway allows and i believe right now it's about 280 days or 81 days something like that um, until we have this crazy uh ap wide if you go over here to the staking you can see that it's still at 50 5,156% uh, APY right now, which is absolutely fantastic in my opinion. Now there's other different forks and other um, DAOs doing different things, but at the same time, guys, a lot of these other products are rug pulling. They're all risky. This is this is very risky, but you know I know what I'm doing. Um, you know, scared money don't make money, but none of this is financial advice. You know, just just be careful when you're aping into these projects because. All this stuff still is experimental, right? I do believe this is the future of cryptocurrency and finance, but who am I, right? But a lot of people I follow believe the same thing, you know? So, you know, we'll see, right? Only time will tell, but I definitely believe in the Olympus DAO. And honestly, it's on the safer side when it comes to DAOs, in my opinion. This is in Time Wonderland, right? Uh, Jade right now is going through some drama. I'm going to make a separate video about Jade because I definitely aped into there at around the uh, high $50 range, right? So not bad, not bad. But right now you can see that I have currently 13.8 S ohm, which is pretty, pretty awesome. Day rate is going to be about 5%. My next reward yield is going to be about this much. And the next reward amount is only going to be this. So it's, you know, kind of a little bit, but you know, whatever. It's still actually free money. And again, we can go to, go to the dashboard and check out the market cap. So about two billy. Um, a lot, of course, the price has been falling, right? Following the market. Um, own price is $418, backed uh, by $110 from the treasury, right? Um, so that's pretty cool, about 25% backing, so not bad. G own price is about 21,000, right? Current index is about 50.84 S ohm. And if you guys didn't know that, like, if you go to your wallet and check your actual ohm, you'll see that um, you have, I mean, I never really deleted these, but I have, you know, this ohm, S ohm, and then I have my G ohm right here. So you can see that uh, although I have 13.8 S ohm, right, which is our st staked ohm, I only have 0 0.272 G ohm. Now, this, of course, G ohm is a governance token. And you're gonna have to wrap your S ohm so that it is G ohm, um, but it's pretty easy to do. Right when you get to the website, it'll help you do it. It'll prompt you, it'll, it'll take you through it. So any more, Olympus DAO that you buy, right? Any more ohm that you buy, you're gonna have to wrap it into a governance uh, token, which is cool. That could because that means you can vote on things. Now I'm not really into the voting yet. I'm gonna get more into that as I, you know, become more educated on everything that's going on. But we'll see what's going on. I'll make more videos in the future about me voting and stuff. But you know, the value of your G ohm, this, this, the number's not gonna change, right? But the value's gonna go up along with the price. So don't let this fool you. I thought I was tripping out because I'm like, I thought I had 13 ohm, but it's really, you know, 0.2 G ohm. So not a big deal. Don't really worry about that. Um, we go over here and yeah, so pretty excited about this. 13.8 um, ohm is actually quite a bit for me. You know, I'm not a whale or anything like that, but I'm excited to see where this goes. Of course, again, like I said before, I'm going to be doing this kind of experiment as long as the runway will allow and the runway is the maximum amount of time that Olympus Dow is going to be offering this insane APY until it drops down to about like 500 or a thousand, something like that, right? Which is still really good. Let's go ahead and check out Bitcoin because um, everything follows Big Daddy Bitcoin now. Fortunately, I was able to buy my last ohm under $400, so that's pretty cool. Uh, mid threes, that was pretty awesome. Felt good to pick up 1.1 ohm for a couple hundred, for like a few hundred bucks. So that's not bad. I hear people saying that Bitcoin, if it drops below 42,000, we can expect some sort of massive drop to its uh, previous um, support, which is about 30,000. Now, the reason why the market's down right now, I mean, the market's actually up today, right? You know, but generally, the reason why the market's been down is because you know it's if, if you know anything about smart money and whales and, and, and those sorts of things a lot of them are do you know using loopholes so they don't have to pay a bunch of taxes on all the gains they made this year and a lot of people with a lot of money made a ton of gains in crypto this year so there's a loophole what you can do and i'll put a link uh, up in the card so you can check out that video that i made on that but what they'll do is they'll sell their profit they'll sell some of their tokens right, at a loss right and just immediately buy back in excuse me some of their coins right these are not tokens these are coins but they'll sell some of the, their crypto right at a loss right and buy back Back in right um, as soon as they can and that's one way to get around paying some taxes right as soon as the tax year uh, is over but I expect us to go on a crazy run you know maybe early January sometime in January because people are gonna be looking to buy back in and I'm bullish on crypto everyone's bullish on crypto I mean and if, if you're betting on crypto you're bullish on crypto and to me you know DAOs are the future of finance a lot of people feel that way um, and I feel that way too 
Um, so, you know, just keep in mind, none of this is financial advice. This is very risky, right? We're all taking a risk with these DAOs. Uh, every other day I see a DAO, you know, rug pulling and whatnot. So like I said before, I really do like Olympus DAO because I feel like it's the most established. That and Hector DAO and Kill and other things like that are more established. So I'm going to stick with this one, although it's not the best APY. Maybe I'll do time in the future, but I aped in the Jade and I'll make a video on that because that's a whole other issue, right? Um, but yeah, let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you like more, uh, if you would like more Olympus DAO content, let me know. I can definitely make that happen. But I'm excited to see where this journey takes me because man, 5,000 APY? Sign me up, baby. And you know what? I'm actually welcoming another market crash. Yes, I've bought a bunch of ohm at different prices, but if the market crashes like crazy and we see like a hundred dollar ohm, oh my goodness. I mean, I'm buying 10, you know what I mean? Uh, but that's just me. I'm, I'm a little crazy. All this stuff is speculation. It's a little risky, but I'm a true degenerate, a degenerate frog, you could say, right? So let me know what you think in the comments down below and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.